And I'm Bill DeFoy. Welcome back to News Junkies. And we're visiting this week with Tim Hockett. And he is the Executive Director of the Community Action of Ventura County. Tim, welcome in here. Thank you very much, Bill. Great to be here. Tim, tell us a little bit about what the Ventura County Action of Ventura County does. Community Action of Ventura County is a private nonprofit. I'm happy to say that just this very week, uh, we're passing our 50th anniversary. We were rolled out as part of the original War on Poverty, and we've been fighting poverty and trying to help lift up uh, low-income people in Ventura County for 50 years. So what are some of the services that you offer? Thank you. We, um, we're best known for energy-related services, energy assistance for low-income folks when they have uh, high power bills, trying to give them uh, uh, some boost and help cover some of their costs. Uh, a lot of low-income folks live in substandard housing, and so they consequently have high energy bills. We also weatherize homes to permanently reduce costs, but we have a lot of other programs. We see uh, uh, and help about 60 homeless people every single day, um, except Wednesday when it's about 120 folks. We provide uh, uh, drop-in services where there's uh, uh, lockers, uh, showers, laundry facilities, and so forth uh, to help homeless folks. We enroll people into other programs like uh, Cal Fresh, which is the food stamp program, Medi-Cal, uh, assisted uh, um, assisting with the cost of uh, medical uh, attention for low-income families, and a few other programs. So it's like a, a one-stop shop for people that are disadvantaged. Well, we, we like to think that we can cover a lot of things, and, and, uh, and we do help a lot of folks in a lot of ways, and what we don't provide directly, we certainly are, uh, know the network well enough to, to uh, refer people to. Okay, now you had mentioned weatherization. What is that? Uh, weatherizing a home uh, tends to be insulating, blow-in insulation, um, weather stripping, all those little measures you can do to help conserve water or power. And uh, we have teams that go in, uh, again, to low-income families. Homes. Uh, the, the, the services we provide don't cost our, the families anything, uh, and so they need to meet certain eligibility criteria, uh, namely low-income. But um, uh, uh, weatherizing is one of my favorite programs because instead of writing a check every month to somebody for their power bill, it, it actually permanently reduces their power. So that is a, a great benefit to those that are participating in that weatherization program. One of the reasons that we are having you on is that there is a big event coming up in the city of Oxnard. It's called the Oxnard Salsa Festival, and this is where nonprofits have an opportunity to get some cash into their coffers, and you're going to have a representative from your organization out there. Tell us about Tyler Marie Watkins. Well, uh, thank you so much, Bill. We, you know, we're very excited to participate. This is the first time we've participated in the Oxnard Salsa Festival. And uh, well, first of all, I love salsa, and I'm going to be spending a couple of days there ha having fun. But during that uh, Dancing with the Community Stars, we have a young lady that's going to dance for us. She's the daughter of our finance director, uh, and she's danced since she was a kid, you know, ballet lessons. And then, and then she finally came into her own in dancing, and... and uh, she actually got, got a, uh, to go on the television show So You Think You Can Dance, and she got the ticket to go to Las Vegas. She didn't advance beyond that, but she's a very good dancer. That said, she'd never danced salsa dancing before, and so she's learning, and, and um, I, I, you know, she's young, and yes, youth is wasted on the young, uh, but we're going to be cheering her on, and we encourage folks to look at the, at the web page for the Oxnard Salsa Festival and, and vote for Tyler. You vote with your dollars, of course. And, uh, and, and she's taken this on, and she's been so mature, and she's, I really want to do this for the organization and help us out. And so it's a way to support a young person and uh, admire some skill. Well, I know that the dancers that participate go through, you know, I think it's like nine weeks of training. Have you had a chance to kind of step in and see how she's coming along? Yeah, yes, we've had a chance to see how she's doing, and she's doing marvelously. And her teacher uh, says that she's pretty much what you'd think, kind of a natural at this, but uh, she's having to learn. And uh, I think it's going to be fun, fun, fun. 
Excellent. Now, for people that want more information about uh, Community Action of Ventura County, would you please give us a telephone number, perhaps a website where people can dial into and get more information about your programs and services? A absolutely. The thing to do is to go to www.ca-vc.org. That's Community Action Ventura County, but there's a hyphen there in that uh, uh, website. Uh, on there, there are telephone numbers. There's a list of uh, programs that we provide, uh, even applications for certain services. Um, we sometimes are looking for board members. There's a wealth of information there. Um, there's also a link to 211, which is a great uh, repository of social service information for people needing help. So uh, www.ca-vc.org. The telephone number is 805-436-4000, but the website's the way to go. Excellent. And I remember the inception of 211, and this was uh, brought out of the necessity of people wanting more information, and sometimes they'd wind up calling law enforcement and fire stations, and so it became really kind of a, a central clearinghouse for services right here in Ventura County. Our good partners at Interface uh, operate uh, 211 for this county, actually for Santa Barbara County as well, and they're great folks. Um, they're not community action, it's just a referral, but uh, it's, it's important to us that when people are looking for help that they know the whole range of uh, options, and certainly we want to help you with what we can at Community Action, uh, but then there's 211 as well. Well, Tim, we look forward to seeing Tyler Marie out at uh, the Salsa Festival this year. If you like more information, you've got the web address, you've got the phone number for Community Action of Ventura County. Tim, thank you for coming in. I know that you're on a tight you leash with your schedule and you've got to go, so we thank you. Come out and see us at the Oxnard Salsa Festival. Excellent. I'm Bill DeFoy with News Junkies, a production of the Heritage Media Group.